Good evening, everybody. If you're new to the channel, my name is Gary, and this is Tech by GP. Tonight, we're using Google Sheets and looking at the HLOOKUP function uh, with a little twist. We're, we're looking at the, uh, HLOOKUP with a drop-down menu. So as you can see here, there's a, um, there's a table here with plant names and megawatt ratings. And what, what you want to do is, um, is to click on the drop-down menu and be able to select the plant and come up with a megawatt rating to the right. So I'll show you guys how to do this coming right up. Okay, so tonight um, we're going to start by uh, deleting these two cells because I, I built this first so I can show you what the end product is, go is going to be and how it's supposed to work. So let's delete it. Okay, so now the... Uh, let's, let's take out the, uh, the data validation. So now the first thing you're the first thing we're going to do here is to set the the, the data validation, which is the drop down menu. So obviously you have a, a set of plant names here on the top, and since since we're going to be doing an an, an H lookup, um, we're going to use those. So <clears throat> so you click on the cell where you want the drop down menu to be. You click on data, click on data validation, okay, and then on the criteria, on the right, on the box, okay, you leave it list from a range, right, and then you click the select data range here, the, um, the grid looking thing, click on that, right, and then you select the plant names. Okay, so it started from cell B1 and and ended in cell L1. So click OK. Okay, so let's click on Save. Okay, so now we have. A drop down menu. So now the next thing is we're going to perform the H lookup. Okay. Equals H lookup. Okay. So the search key is the plant name. So, and uh, since we built a drop down menu for that, we're going to click on that. So that's going to be our search key, so that when you when you when you use the drop down menu, every time you use it and you select another plant, it will um, it will show the H lookup where to look, and get the information from that point. So that's B six where um, the key is going to be. So B six, right? Comma. On the range, we just select this. Uh, uh, the, the table here okay we since we're on the uh, on the Mac we hit function f4 okay, to make it a absolute reference comma okay so now um, if you looked at the prior lesson in, in VLOOKUP, we were counting from left to right, and we started from the cell where the information was. So starting with the, uh, the cell where the plant names are, uh, instead of looking left to right, we're going to look up going down. So um, if, the, if one is the count on where the plant name is, the megawatt rating or where the number is, is 2, because you count 1 and then 2, right? So 2, comma, and then false.
enter. Okay, so Gordonsville 100. Okay, so now when we click on the on the um, drop down menu here, every time you change the name of the plant, you select a new plant, it will come up with the megawatt rating here on the table. Okay, that uh, concludes our lesson for tonight. I hope you guys found this helpful, and I'll see you next video. Thank you very much.